AutoDS Dropshipping for Beginners How to Start Dropshipping with AutoDS Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, I'll show you guys how you can get started with dropshipping using AutoDS. So let's get into it. Now I have opened up my Shopify store over here and I'll go into settings and then go into apps and sales channels and then open up our Shopify app store. From here, we are going to integrate AutoDS into our Shopify store. The reason for that is because I am using Shopify to build my website or my store, and then I will be using AutoDS as the platform to find suppliers and find the appropriate product. Now, what AutoDS does for you is that it becomes the middleman because AutoDS provides you with a platform that can help you in automating your dropshipping. You can find some verified suppliers that you know and trust, and you can make sure that those suppliers provide you with a good quality of product that are sent to your customers. Plus, you will see that all of your orders can be routed very easily directly into AutoDS, and if you take a look at their pricing, although they are more expensive than some of the free alternatives out there, they have a better quality control over all of their features as well as products. So we're just going to click on install over here and then complete our installation of AutoDS. Once you do that, you have to choose a plan. Now, if you're worried about not being sure about using AutoDS, keep in mind that you always have a free trial that you can avail. So as you guys can see, First off, you can click on approve over here, and then you will get a 14 day free trial. So for your 14 day free trial, once you have completed your 14 days, you can select that plan or a alternate plan, and you will see the billing. Now, as you guys can see, we have our free plan over here. We have a 21 day money back guarantee. And then let's say I want to change our plan to a monthly billing instead. Now with annual billing, you do get 25% off. However, with monthly billing, you don't get that extra 25% off. Once you do that, click on continue over here. And once you click on continue, your installation of AutoDS will be completed. So click on approve over here to complete your installation. And now you're ready to go with AutoDS. Now, once our installation of AutoDS has been completed, we can get started with setting up our Shopify store integrations as well as our product. So to get started, the first thing that I would like to do is go through the panels of AutoDS. So on the left, you have a marketplace section. Then you have a hand-picked product section, which are currently the trending product on AutoDS. Then you have a TikTok spy. This is a add-on feature that you can purchase with AutoDS that enables you to find trending products that AutoDS is providing that are currently trending on TikTok. Then you have a trending product section. Now below that, you have a print on demand section. So instead of having to go to another platform like Printify or Gelato, you can do all of your print on demand based product from here as well. Below that, you have a basic dashboard that can enable you to see a summary of all of your revenue, profit orders as well. And then you also have a order section separately. And then you have a product section. So most frequently, we're going to be working in the product section and the marketplace section. And on the top, you have your Shopify store connection where you can add multiple stores on one account. Now I will click on product and we are going to go on ahead and click on see more products and you can just go into the marketplace. Now, once you click on the marketplace on the top, you have a few filters that you can apply. So let's say that I want to base my business in Canada. So I'm going to change the country to Canada because that is where I am expecting most of my orders to be from. Then I have the currency. So let's say I want to use USD and then you can choose a ships from country. Now, the reason why you would want to choose a ships from country is because if you're looking to get faster shipping, that is why you try to find a country that is close by or the same country to make sure that your product to reach your customers in a very quick time. However, most of these suppliers are going to be foreign, so the supply times may vary. After that, you have a price range as well as a supplier. So if this should be a AutoDS supplier, a AliExpress supplier, or a Amazon supplier. I'm only going to put in the country filter. And now from here, some of the top products will be listed right down below. 
Now, after that, you can search for any product that you want. So I will search for sweater and just go on ahead and search for the item you want. Now, you will get some search results and it's best if you are very specific on what you're trying to find. So if I want, I would click on best sellers over here in the sweater category. And now it's going to show me the best sellers in the sweater category. And you can also click on fast shipping to see products that have the fastest shipping available. So I will search for cashmere sweater like this. And then now it's going to show me some cashmere sweaters over here. There are a lot of different options, but I want to take one of the trending products that they have. So the trending products are the ones that are going to be shown on default when you don't search for anything. So you guys can see these are some of the trending products and it makes a lot of sense because these are probably products that you have seen on TikTok. So let's say that I want to proceed with this mini printer. So I will click on the listing over here. Once you click on the listing, this will show you the full listing, the product IDs and the source. If you click on the source, you will be able to see any of the other listings that have been created by the same store. Then you have a ships from section. So this ships from China. And then we also have the color that we want. So they have a bunch of different colors available. Then they have the shipping price to Canada. So it could be anywhere between zero to $59. And then the shipping and processing time. Now for this particular product, the shipping and processing time is 12 to 24 days. So this is a bit too long. That is why I'm going to find an alternate product instead. And I can even just search for this type of product. So I'll search for thermal printer over here and once I search for a thermal printer it can show me some other alternate options available so they have a few different options let's take a look at this listing over here and you guys can see the shipping and processing time for this one is 7 to 29 days which is a better estimate so I'll keep on looking and we have this one over here as well this is 12 to 24 days but I am going to keep on looking and I'm just going to just search for printer instead of thermal printer. And I'll search for a mini printer instead because that is what we are specifically looking for. And this is one thing I really like about AutoDS is that you have a wide array of products available that you can choose from. Now, once you have the product that you want, so if you're satisfied with the shipping prices, the overall processing times, what you're going to do now is you can go on ahead and click on import draft. Now, once you do that, you will be able to see the product in your draft on the left. So on the bottom left, you're going to click on draft and then you can click on more options and then you can schedule your listing or click on click to edit to begin editing your listing. So from here, I will add this as cute mini printer, and then I can choose a Shopify collection. I will add this to my homepage collection. And then we have the tags. I will remove the home tags. I will add cute, maybe printer like this. I'll add these tags. And then you have the shipping method. So fastest with tracking, cheapest with tracking, or just the cheapest shipping. So I want to go with the cheapest shipping possible. And we have the default city, the country location, and the brand we want to use. So I want to use the brand Emelyn. And then you have monitoring as well. If you want to do price monitoring, stock monitoring, and auto orders. Once you've completed the customization of your listing, click on save or save and import to directly import your listing. Now that your listing has been imported, you will be able to see it in your product section. So you guys can see on the top, we have our product that is being imported. And now if I go into my Shopify store, I will go into products, and then I'm just going to wait a couple of seconds for the import to be completed. So our product has now been imported. You will see the variations on hold, out of stock, and then the total products that we have. And if I refresh my Shopify page, I will be able to see this newly imported product from AutoDS into our Shopify store. So here is our printer and it has been added to our Shopify store with all of the different color variations. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and you are now able to get started with AutoDS dropshipping with Shopify. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe.